John, there's a couple of quotes on your new album I found amusing and interesting enough to ask you about. Possession is nine-tenths of the problem. Oh, yes. <laughs> that, that seems to be uh, uh, on your album. And, and did you really see a UFO? I did really. I wouldn't have put it on, you know, if I hadn't seen there's it. There's a little tiny note that people could miss if they don't look carefully down in one of the lower corners of your uh, liner notes. It says, I saw a UFO, September something, something, something. W what was the story behind that? Where, where did that happen? Well, I was in New York in an apartment, and I was just standing by the roof, and I looked left, and there was this thing about 100 yards away. And I could have hit it with a stone if I threw it. And it was really, I could have even seen it without my glasses, and I'm very short-sighted. <laughs> And I was looking at it and thinking, what is it? What is it? You know, is it a helicopter? No, it's making no noise. Is it a balloon? You know, is it the blimp? Because uh -huh. there's all these lights around the bottom of it uh -huh. flashing on and off. It didn't say American Airlines on it, did it? Said, <laughs> it didn't say anything. It didn't make a noise. And you know, one part of me all the time was saying, that's a UFO, you know. Uh -huh. But I, you, some part of you doesn't want to believe it, you know. Did you uh, did you go to the authorities with that information? I, well, I didn't because, you know, Lennon sees UFO. I mean, that's enough to get me kicked out for, you know, it's bad enough as it is. <laughs> I suppose. It would be... That's why I, I, wasn't, I almost took it off the album. But one time I, I said, pull it off. A, I'm going to get people with weird-looking eyes coming up to me saying, I've come from the saucer, you know. And I've seen it too, yeah. Yeah, yeah. and the other bit is they're going to say he's crazy, you know. But I thought, look. I saw it, you know, I don't care what anybody says, there it was, and nobody can explain what it was to me, so it's, I said UFO, you know. Amazing, this is in California. No, this was in New York. New York of all places. It was below the height of, of the buildings. <laughs> I mean, it was it was like, you know, if somebody had been in a higher building, they would have looked down on it. Did, did you talk to anybody else that said they, uh, that they saw it too? Uh, I got a friend to call the police and call the newspapers the next day uh -huh. to check if anybody else had seen anything. Uh -huh. And a couple of people had rung in and seen something in the same area at the same time as me. People in New York are sometimes oblivious to reality, though. Things could be happening around them and they wouldn't even notice it. You know, well, the... I'll stick up for New York a bit. I think it's pretty real here, you know. It's just that, you know, I would never have noticed if I hadn't happened to look out. You know, I looked around me and nobody else was looking out of windows or anything. The cars were going on because it's quiet. Mm -hmm. It's very low. It's not that you expect a sort of Martian in the sky. It was below rooftop level and it was just coasting around very quietly like a tourist, you know. It's amazing. And it was just pot luck that I saw it. Amazing. Excuse the expression. <laughs> and I was straight as a die. I was, I was straight as a die. Over yeah. here. Up there, I saw a UFO, and it went down the river, turned right at the United Nations, <laughs> turned left, and then down the river. It wasn't a helicopter, it wasn't a balloon, and it was so near. And it looked, what, sort of uh, round, just, white, just luminescent, like, and silent. Uh, silent, and it looked dark, like black or grey in the middle, and had white lights, just looked like light bulbs, you know? Just going off, on, off, on, off, on, blink, 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 round the bottom, and on top was a red light.